Now all that rain we've seen this year means a lot of standing water, which is prime breeding ground for mosquitoes. CBSH Brian White checked in with the County Vector Control Program. They monitor insects and animals that can transmit disease to humans to see what effects all the rain is having on mosquitoes and other bugs. Right now we're seeing it starting to warm up and we're starting to see the mosquitoes getting active again. Allison Bray with the county's vector control program says standing water left over from recent rains makes perfect conditions for mosquitoes to multiply. And that's where mosquitoes lay their eggs and grow when they're young. So more standing water could mean more mosquitoes. The county inspects and treats, if necessary, over 1,500 sources of standing water throughout San Diego County. And for some sites like larger ponds, lagoons, and lakes, they'll use a helicopter to drop granules of bacterial larvicide, which kills mosquito larvae. Here in the water, you can see bouncing around in there, the mosquito larvae. When it's warm outside, a mosquito can go from an egg to an adult in as little as five to seven days. That's why she says it's important to check around our homes for standing water. You should look pretty much anywhere that can hold at least a quarter inch of water. So even the saucers under a potted plant. And if you have a backyard pond or something like that, the county's vector control program has a solution for you. Here are our mosquito fish. These fish love to eat mosquito larvae. You can pick them up for free at their office in Kearney Mesa or at one of their 10 distribution sites throughout the county. <laughs> And mosquitoes aren't the only bugs flourishing with all the rain. Bees are having a go of it too. Once the nectar and the pollen start flowing, um, that will stimulate the queen to start laying more eggs. She'll lay two to 3,000 eggs a day. Mike Stanton is a bee wrangler for Eliza's Bee Removal. He says they're getting a lot of calls about bee swarms right now. And there are a few ways to prevent this around your home. Any little hole, you see a hole in your house bigger than a quarter inch, Clock it, um, your, your events, put new mesh on them. But as for mosquitoes, Allison says the best way to keep them from biting is to wear an insect repellent, especially those with an EPA approved active ingredient. You want to look for one that contains DEET, picaridin, IR3535, or oil of lemon eucalyptus. I'm Brian White for CBSA.